What's up guys, it's your boy DJ Stash again on the review. In today's episode, I'm reviewing the 1835 Bourbon Apple Pie Whiskey Liqueur. Come and take it. It's uh, pretty much a Texas whiskey, 70 proof. 35% Uncle Pie volume, so not too bad. It's got like a Jim Bean volume. So, yeah. It's got on the back. It says in 1835, the first battle for Texas independence was fought. The white makeshift flag bearing a painted image of the cannon was proudly raised. The flag simply said, come and take it. More than 175 years later, the same spirit of Texas pride and independence continues. 1835, apple pie bourbon is handcrafted in limited quantities. In every patiently aged sip, you will find bright aromas of vanilla, caramel, and spice, rich flavors of oak and brown sugar. Linger into a sweet, full-body finish, a standalone bourbon that probably speaks for itself. So yeah, like an independent bourbon pretty much here in Texas. It says bottled by 1835 in Dallas, Texas. Okay. Yeah, this is like on sale on spec, so that's why I picked up with that apple cider OG beer. It was like 22 bucks for this, so it wasn't bad. I mean, I was trying to look for uh, flavor whiskey, and I'm just getting a hard, hard time, because uh, usually I've been getting like Jimmy Maple in the big 1.75 liter bottles, but they discontinued that, so then I went with... Uh, like the honey one and they didn't have that size currently at that time and then uh i was also getting a crown royal maple and didn't see that anymore so i don't even know if they're discontinuing that or not I didn't ask i was like what that but then i saw this i was like it was cheap and it's apple pie flavored so Let's see if we get hopefully this will be good I haven't opened yet so got some expectations for this Hopefully it'll be pretty good. I'm going to put it back, close it back with a cork. Mm. There we go. I guess, oh, okay. Shape like that. Give it a smell. Ooh. Yeah, it smells whiskey, alright. Yeah, it smells like apple pie. I do this smell of vanilla notes. Mm. Alright. I got in my uh, chaser shot. Some uh, lemon lime twist up. Alright. Pour some in here. to the top see so yeah, I close it back yep cool alright guys 1835 bourbon apple pie whiskey liqueur cheers mm. not bad I mean, definitely uh, get the spices. How much burn? I mean, 35%. It's not bad with that. It's a good chaser. Yeah, now I'm getting the aftertaste. That's, that's not bad. Yeah, caramel. A little bit of caramel. Yeah, this is brown sugar linger. Yeah, I, I can tell like after the taste, it kind of that between his lingers after a while. That's not bad. I mean, it's not bursting with all that flavor, but I mean, it's I see it's, it's spot on. They're on the right direction. I mean, for independent, what it is, it's not bad. It's about average. Give this a give this a four out of five. I would definitely uh, try to pick this up again for I me and for the deal I got. It's not too bad. Definitely, you have no problem killing this bottle. <laughs> Alright, guys, 1835 bourbon apple pie whiskey liqueur. Come and take it, you motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah. Alright, guys. I hope you enjoyed this view, the video. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, guys, your boy, GI Stats, and peace.